Alright, hey guys, it's like uh, the second time I'm trying to do this. But what we're gonna make is a simple motion screen, not using the um, bone tool. So I'm just gonna make a uh, torso right here. And I'm just gonna F8. And I'm gonna make it a movie clip. You have to make sure it's a movie clip. Registration point doesn't matter. Just name it. Whatever. Dude. And I'll just right click down here and click on edit. We're gonna call this uh, torso. I'm gonna make two more layers. One's gonna be left leg. One's gonna be right leg. So um, on left leg frame, you're gonna wanna make a um, something sticking out this way. And the right leg frame, you're gonna make something sticking out this way. Now, um, you can do this, you can do what frame you want, I'm gonna make it 50. And then, um, I'm gonna make, make click, click on create classic tween, create classic tween, and create classic tween. So now what we're gonna make is a, um, make on the right leg, we'll put it about half. We're gonna make it where the legs are, go up or something. So we're gonna make it like that. And then, um, oops, alright, it, it automatically put it right there, and then the torso, of course, if, if you made, if you made, uh, more stuff, like arms and stuff, you'd do exactly the same thing, and, um, so let's look at this, alright, so on the torso, I'm gonna go back up. I'm gonna make it up, back up straight. Like that, and then on this, we're gonna make it where it looks. It goes back down. And then on this, so now let's look at what we have. A simple little tween of that. And we're gonna go back to scene one, and then we're gonna put this out. How many frames is on? I'll just put it to 58 too. Go back over here and right click classic tween. So now we have like a jumping right. So what we wanna do is we wanna make him up right here. We wanna make it all the way down to right here, right in the middle. We want it to go, I guess, up a little bit. At the end, we'll make it go back down. Let's see what we have. A problem messed up a little bit. Oh, that actually worked. So, let's try and make it a little simple classic train. And if you want to make it where you actually know precisely how where to jump, where it jumps, you might want to go back, go back to the to the movie clip and see that it starts on it starts on the 22nd frame. So you can go back here and go to. 22nd frame and make it where his legs are open so you know exactly that that's where you want it and all this stuff. Alright, bye.